New Year. 2000. I don't know. 17. 17. 17. It's a good round number. Sounds good. I think it's a Ferrari. Generally, only Ferraris do that kind of thing, so. We'll be right back. We're just driving around today. We did go to a car show, not a show that we could shoot. No. So we decided to come up, go to the rock store, or drive down through the snake in Ken's little car. This little slow car. What does this car have in it? Big motor. <laughs> Greasy spoon. That wasn't uh, not too bad. It was really good. Not too bad. Uh, I didn't even get a spoon. We ordered rocks. <laughs> This place to take pictures of the car and there's a photo shoot going on from this guy looks good what do you think this is so pretty <laughs> this is insane Everybody's out today. There are car clubs, cool cars, pretty much everywhere. But I've kind of had my fill of driving around today. Ken and I drove pretty much all through Malibu, went to the rock store, did a, did a bunch of different things. But now I'm back at the pad. Kathy is still not feeling that good. But she did mention that she wanted some pie. So we're gonna have some cherry pie.
resolutions. Why is it that we only think about resolutions January 1st? We don't really think of it the rest of the year. In fact, most of us will put together a list of resolutions and then by February 1st, they're pretty much out the window. We'll get into that in a second. But uh, I did want to mention about Ken's car. Uh, if you want to know more about that incredible hot rod Porsche thing that he drives, the Wicked 356, uh, we shot a five minute drive episode and I'm going to I'm gonna link that down in the show notes so you guys can watch that. Um, it gives much more detail on it. Uh, we just went, you know, piddling around today. We, we went to a, a car show that was north that, that I'm really not supposed to reveal the location so I decided not to vlog that and, and we've been there before so you guys probably know what that show is but driving in that car this morning it was about 40 degrees it was freaking cold and then we drove around it's just you know spectacular car just you know he's an amazing builder and done a lot of really great things but back to resolutions you know resolutions are you know are things that oh man my battery's gonna go dead I forgot to charge it we do resolutions because we think our life needs improvement and and it does in the sense that we constantly want to improve you should want to improve your life you should look at, at your health and think your health can be better or look at your finances and your finances could be better or or your relationships or, there's always room for improvement there's battery went dead all good there's never an aspect of your life that you you shouldn't want to improve you, you want to constantly improve you want to, you know things to get better and there are ways to do that and doing resolutions is kind of a reminder but through conditioning and through all the the things that we think we're supposed to be doing we feel we have an obligation that january 1st is a, a chance to start over and honestly the way i look at it is that every day that i wake up is a chance to start over a fresh day is like a blank canvas resolutions or things that you want to resolve or are ever present and on a daily basis you want to strive to improve that you know you want to go to the gym you want to get that one extra rep you want to eat a slightly better meal for lunch you want to get a raise at work even if it's just for a dollar but in any case any resolution is something uh, worth striving for it's something working hard to, to achieve you want to be able to achieve that you want to look forward you want to to enjoy that process it shouldn't be drudgery or it's not a resolution improvement works when you set a goal and you seek to improve it and seek to to do things that makes that goal come to fruition it's something that that's worth uh, doing something that worth uh, striving for and and being able to achieve it's like Ken with his cars you know you 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 can do a sketch you can come up with an idea but but those that really succeed and achieve are the ones that that conceptually they, they create a really great idea and it comes to fruition success in resolutions requires you to know what it is that you want and in doing that you you create awareness you you uh, let people know that this is what you're striving for you know most people they'll they'll do a resolution but they won't tell anybody when you tell somebody you make it real you get out there and you you put yourself on the line you burn your your bridges behind you and you move forward and then you got to put a plan together you got to you got to seek uh, uh, components and things that you have to do to put together to make that that goal come to fruition it's very hard to do that when you have a, a super large goal because then it's hard to see all those smaller parts that's why I like looking at resolutions on a daily basis because today I can think about the things I want to achieve in the larger scale what can I just do today then you got to get out there you got to do those things on a daily basis one after the other just succeed at one thing don't think about the next thing just focus on the one thing you're gonna do today and if you follow that succession if you keep going then you're bound to succeed you're bound to hit the goal that you want and in that case resolutions are easy so for 2017 you have to realize that you will hit your goals it doesn't really matter exactly when you just have to know what you want and you got to take steps towards it but make those steps you know quantifiable but make them small enough to where you can achieve things on a daily basis you can feel good about it because that's really the bottom line you want to feel good about what it is that you're doing and you want to succeed and you will succeed as long as you hang out with us here on the vlog because you're going to get a jolt right in the arm every single day so that's it for today that this is vlog 520 be sure to hit the like button i love hanging out with you guys and getting a chance to talk discuss cool things show you some cool stuff but most of all show you how you can succeed through what it is that you love so just remember identify the thing that you want and just go out there and get it but most of all don't stop until you achieve it and the last one the fourth one that's my pinky i don't I don't want to have anything for that.
It's basically three things. Okay, have a spectacular year, people. You guys deserve it. Make this year, 2017, the absolute very best that you possibly can. Just do it on a daily basis. If you can't do it on an entire day, then do it on an hourly basis. Go do whatever you're doing right now, but do it to the absolute best of your ability, even if it means making a bowl of cereal. Okay, peace out, people. We'll see you tomorrow.